Hi everyone, uh, just a quick video today to share with you my latest um, mixed media loose leaf journaling page and this is what I've created. The background on here was done like the last piece that I showed you which was the Lumiere paints. This time I used um, I used the Halo Blue Gold again which is one of my favourite colours um, and I used it with the Pearl Violet and there was a little bit also of some of the pearl white and some of the true gold as well but not very much um, and what I did with this I painted the background with the acrylics um, using a credit card just to scrape the paints on and I added a little bit of gesso as well onto there just to lighten it then it was stamped with this stamp here which is um, a Stampatique um, rubber stamp and I stamped it all over to begin with and then you can barely see it at the bottom now um, because I did a lot more layers of paint and things um, but after I'd stamped over it I decided that I was going to keep this part of it and I wanted to add some images onto there so I've got another stone angel image there um, I think I've said before that I really like stone angel images and it's just one off the internet and this one here is a door um, that is by Paper Whimsy so I added those and I also added actually before I put those down I did some torn book page so you can see where a piece was across there and another piece across here and there's one here as well so I did those first and then painted over them and then I also um, painted over these images once I put them down just to blend them in and that was with a um, glaze so I used my glaze medium again this is the um, glaze medium that I showed on my last video so I just mixed that with some of the Lumiere paints to line it up so I didn't lose the images completely and then I went over the part where it said spiritual journey with um, a black pen just to bring that part out a little bit more and I stamped um, this part here um, start from the very beginning the start from uses the autumn leaves license plate um, font then um, the very um, text used a paper artsy um, stamp set um, and it is it's this one here which is a typewriter font um, and it's called words plate 2 and there's the URL um, so I use that quite a lot and then the beginning part that wasn't a stamp that was a, a rub on that I had then around around that um, I stamped there's some Tim Holtz the little alphabet from the I think it's from the mini grunge set and there's some speckles that was a stamping up stamp um, there's also another Tim Holtz stamp there that's from I forget which set it's from but um, it's the one that sort of looks like frayed material and then I went over it all again with more paint, more layers on this part here may cause drowsiness that's from Darkroom Door so it's this set here which is called Mail Art and I can't see the stamp there it is it's that stamp there um, and it kind of tied in with what I was trying to say with this piece so it was about um, going on a spiritual journey with my new sort of art journaling pages that I'm doing and then it said sort of start from the very beginning and then as with any sort of journey where you're going through your life and things like that um, not necessarily cause drowsiness but it can be quite exhausting um, so I thought that little stamp went quite well so that is my latest page um, oh I did add as well you can see where it shines in parts I actually went over it with um, a crystal lacquer um, that was had like a gloss finish so I went over it with that and then added more gesso and more acrylic and then sort of scraped off parts um, so you had sort of the combination of bits of shiny parts with the um, obviously the dull areas as well the matte finishing areas so there's just a little bit of the the shine here and there um, so that's my latest page um, hope you like it um, 
leave me a comment if you've got any questions. Thanks for watching. Bye!